The QHack 2023 quantum coding challenges ended about a week ago. So what I want to do in the next coming weeks is go over some of the solutions to these problems uh, step by step. Hopefully I'll be able to go over all of them, but it might take quite some time. But uh, I'm going to I'm going to try my best. Now, one thing I notice about these problems is that uh, they have a lot of additional stuff around them. So for example, there's a storyline that, that uh, is being followed. So what I want to do is actually try to focus just on the quantum computing part of the problem and explain as clearly as possible what we're being asked to do. So you won't get the, the whole story, but at least we will go over uh, what I consider is the most important part and is how to solve the problems. Uh, so for example, here on this uh, first problem, um, we're being asked something very simple like uh, implement a program that adds two numbers. So, so obviously I won't make a separate video for this one. Uh, but a another important thing I want to highlight is that we, in, in a lot of these problems, we're given uh, this template to, to work on and then only certain cells are activated to put our results. And it has a lot of additional code to either implement uh, helper functions or uh, to implement code that will verify the solution. So what I'm actually going to do is try to create the solution from scratch on a Jupyter notebook. And if there are any helper functions that, that we need that are provided to us, I'll just probably copy and paste them uh, as we go and, and try to explain what they do. And then for the grading, um, what I'll do is I'll try to just copy and paste the, the inputs and, and just show you that, that the output to each problem kind of matches what, what is given. I, I don't want to use the template itself because it's uh, prone to a lot of errors if, if I'm copying and pasting the whole thing. So uh, I think it's a little bit easier if we, if we do it just um, starting from a blank notebook and, and explain uh, everything step by step. So let me know if you have any questions and hope to see you in the next video.